outside didn't we but you know Ellen came along and just ruined it for us to be honest and if you're wondering Ellen is she's that bloody storm that came down to Cork and fucking ruined it so anyway we're in here we're nice and cozy this is the underground ovation bunker and today we have got a new guest for you haven't we yep now we're going to start off with a tune I'm going to keep you thinking about it because well if you're watching it should actually be on the bottom it's the remote DJs can we get annoyed So first tune, this is brand new, brand, brand new. In fact, it's from the one and only a Reflux and it's called Sonorous. So wrap your ears around it because it's absolutely lethal. I hope you're feeling the vibe. Episode four, Raw Vision, Nat Mac, Underground Ovation. Safety first, wearing the mask. So let's face it, we're not going anywhere. So I hope you're tuned in. I hope you enjoy the show or enjoy the show. We've got some unreleased tracks here for you. This, of course, is Reflux, a local act from Cork. Two of them, James and Ryan. Ryan's part of Underground Ovation. Big ups to Ryan. So, some news for you. I should tell you that if you didn't go to 6CK, it was cancelled. Unfortunately, Dali has also been cancelled. So, I'd like you to click on our bio and there's a link for Dali to raise money to keep it alive. So, make sure you go check that out. That's on Underground Ovation's Instagram bio. And let's just support the scene because we've got to keep it going, right? But first, turn it up nice and loud. Here we go. Hey!
So I hope you know these guys. Sunday Dust, this one is called. Cedarwood State Tracks. Big, big fan on the Raw Vision Mix Show. By the man himself, Woriski. A nice little edit for you. And if you tuned into our first show, I gave you the news that actually coming on this show. But for now, stay tuned. We've got giveaways, we've got information, and we've got the Reboot DJs. Here we go. ticket. Apparently there's one for grabs. Also, we've got a little bit of merchandise as well. So if you want to check yourself, get some clobber, you know what to do. Like, share, support the scene. Let's fucking do it.
as Carl Cox would say, oh yes, oh yes. New, new, new and fresh. Raw Vision right here. This is Presswork Outsider. Another Irish ex. Grab your ears round it. Let's go. Yes, Rebu in the house. Whoop. Hey, here we go. So good, so good. Thank you for so having us. How are you us. doing? You alright? Yeah, so good, so good. Yeah. Oh, spot man, absolutely amazing. Tell us, tell us a little bit about yourself. You're obviously Reboot DJ, so who are you? Fact, but firstly, what about you guys, man? We have Nah here, we have Hannah who's at home, unfortunately. Yeah. We have Ryan here in the yes, background. Yes, yes, yes. And as uh, Nah touched on earlier on, like this is like Plan C. We need to see Plan A, which yeah, we'll come back the next we'll year. Come when back, the we'll come better. back, we'll come back. We'll come back. We'll be fresh, we'll be fresh. <laughs> a few things to know. Firstly, this mask obviously restricting me conversation, but I still let it flow. <laughs> Secondly, I've been on this since one o'clock today, so a disclaimer. Some of the things I might say aren't actually fucking, maybe not be, might be facts for <laughs> any of you people eavesdropping out there want to use in a negative way, just so we know. But so yes, who we are. Where are you from? Uh, we're based from County Mead, but we run all over a whole load of regions. We're blessed to be followers and friends everywhere. We have uh, Dean Elso. He's Yay! our, uh, he's, yep, yep, yep. <laughs> he's our social media manager. AR manager all around Bowsy on the session though. We need to watch out for him. We need to carry him on sometimes. <laughs> Next up we have Connor Mack. He's our event manager. Man? Artos liaison. All around smiley top tier buzzer without him. To be honest, some of our shit wouldn't happen. Excuse <laughs> me language. <laughs> Next Next up you have uh, myself and Jamie, we're co-founders. Uh, Jamie's the easy-go-lucky one. I suppose you could say we're the creative directors, but Jamie's the easy-go-lucky. I'm the grumpy owl lad, just in case anybody wants to know. But we, have, we have a few other little people in the background that are starting to do our underground shit that you might hear about later on, but like they handle all underground and some little offence like that. No so, and on top of that, not only us, like um, obviously we all have our strengths, we all have our weaknesses. Together we're not a whole lot. Oh no, separately we're not a whole lot, but together... That's what makes You're it strong and special. Man. But what makes it more special is our friends and followers. Oh no, ah, actually, that's it. That's our it. followers that's are actually all our friends. We've all, we know, literally, we literally know everybody. Everybody who ever come to one of our events, you know the story. We're in the middle of the floor. We're partying with you. You become friends for life, and that's, yeah, that's that we're it. blessed to have them. It's in the first great place. That you have that to give us, man. It's really important oh, right mate, now. That's what makes the scene great, yeah. Tell us a little bit about PME then. So obviously that's been happening. Yeah, that's been happening, but like how that came about. So like, so this year alone was meant to be our year, and we had we had ten major international shows we didn't get to announce. Yeah. We had a few that we did announce, like Alan Fitzpatrick. We yeah. had um, Mara Bacato coming later yeah. on in the year. We had the Life Festival launch party with Sunil yeah. Sharp, and like can I just say, Sunil Sharp, give us a night. He's on the new task force. He's the man who's going to make our scene the way it should be, ah, the way it is exactly. in any other country. Because, yeah. So heads up, heads up, heads up, you, my boy. Yes, yes. And then on top of that, I said we had 10 international shows we didn't get to announce. That's um, it. We, we were meant to, we were absolutely blessed and absolutely honoured. The D8 boys and Life Festival boys took us on. We were going to be involved in Life Festival. We had the York City boys, we were going to be involved in that. Um. And then we had all the independent festivals like Fwinov, Audio Garden, um, Solace that we were meant yeah. to be involved in and we had a whole lot of other yeah, stuff not yeah. announced so like everybody else we were struggling we're dealing with the COVID we're trying to live with the COVID situation the way it is and to be honest it was, it was hard but the one thing you have to remember try to have that positive, positive mental energy and that's where PME came yeah. about yeah, yeah, yeah. Woohoo! 
<laughs> and to be honest, it was it was uh, Hardy Bow's uh, brainchild, and we loved it, so we ran with it. <laughs> just let me let me tell you a few things about it. So basically, it was just about trying to bring all our friends and family together in like a safe space, adhering to government guidelines. Like we had um, 100 people capacity, which was half the capacity that was allowed for. We did that as a safety precaution. Yeah, Hand right. sanitizer stations, fully insured, private fence, private land, social distance. We even went to trouble and marking out even all the campsites to make sure. The centre point was eight metres apart, so that well adapts for the two metre apart rule that was in place. We had a whole load of other stuff in place, and it was just amazing. The first one was family and friends, as I said. The second was family and friends, and uh, so we released a few promotional videos, as you know, and yeah. uh, they went down the hip. But then promotional videos were only for what was meant to follow. Like we obviously, if restrictions less a bit more, we're hoping to turn it into something else. We had a show scheduled for the 29th of August. We were oh, after no. building, as you know, not you yeah. seeing, we were after building 15 of yeah. these reboot social distance booths. Special all, booths. Yeah, yeah. Oh, man, you could sit 95 people and that's us reboot. around. Reboot. <laughs> reboot. Yeah, reboot, reboot. <laughs> Never mind reboot. Reboot. <laughs> reboot. Go with that actual H. Reboot. <laughs> and like that seat and 90 people and that was just around the uh, stage area. Yeah. We had other seatings. We had cover pill tables. We had everything. Well, everything I'm in gonna, place. I'm going to say, right, what you did and what you've done is nothing that anyone else is doing. So I want to say congratulations and thank you. Oh, thank you. For doing what you're doing. Yes, 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 yes. yes. And and thinking. Well, again, well, again. So thank you. Just let me tell you, hold on, hold on. That's down to our friends and family who are even supporting us, even throwing yeah, donations towards trying what we're trying to do. That's it. And we're trying to build an infrastructure, as you said, like if things are less relaxed a bit more, obviously clubs and stuff are like in doubt for we don't know how long. It was up to the government. That's we're it. trying to bring infrastructure that would hopefully allow that us to bring a safe place, even safer place to get ready and party exactly. together at some stage. And like obviously the new restrictions that are announced within two hours, we had one on 29. We told everybody it's cancelled. Yeah. We're all about yeah. following the guidelines, doing something. Hey, Exactly. Whether people agree with them or not, you have to buy by the rules. If you don't buy by the rules, we'll, they'll have ammunition to try to shut down what we're trying to do. And exactly. like Sunil Sharp, as I said, task force, like, where would you get it? Like, one of us coming up, pushing it for the last two years, and now looking at him, he's on a task force. And I guarantee yes. you he'll make something amazing for us. Yeah, and so speaking of keeping it going, right? Yeah, yeah. We keep this going, and we, we want to make sure that we show different acts and bring you down. Thank you so much for coming down for being on the Raw Vision Underground Show. Underground Elevation, yep, yeah. Yeah. yeah! So, tell us what kind of journey you're going to take us on tonight. What's, what's your track selection? What, what, what uh, are you take us on? Well, track selection, I'm, I'm on the rollover, so, like, literally, we're the same as all the Review DJs. Uh, so, Dean Elso is, like, uh, deep... Techno, Connor's new to the game, learning man, learning so many his crowds on wheels <laughs> at the PME. He's all about house, loving fives. I'm about anything and everything you want to ever want them on. Whatever the crowd plays, I play the Sweet. Harry Ball's nearly the well, same man. We're gives looking people forward to it. Yeah, we're yeah. really looking forward Thank to you. it. So I'm gonna pass over to you. Is there anything <laughs> else you wanna to say to the audience? Yeah, I just wanna say, um, so I don't know if you've been following Reboot, if you haven't, so we've been doing some things in the background. Uh, we launched a new record label there recently. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. So, and of course, our first concept had to be uh, Reboot Emerald Selections. The, yes. the whole concept in the name. We touched base with uh, the amazing artists that are in Ireland right now. Oh my yeah, God. We played like, one of them last week on the yeah. show, actually. Remedy. Yeah. What, Remedy, yeah, from Cork. We had yeah. BLK from down yeah, yonder. We had yeah, people from yeah. everywhere. And like, we launched that. We launched three new platforms. We launched our Bandcamp platform, SoundCloud, YouTube, Reboot TV. And like for the first album, nice, we busy. had I think 600 downloads on Bandcamp. We had 1,000 views on uh, YouTube. Yeah. We had 27,000 27, plays on SoundCloud. We already have our next VA planned. We're on to we have some major international artists on. Obviously, we're still waiting to get in a few more, a few more locals, bring everybody to the scene. That's what we're about. We also we're launched uh, at the start of the pandemic. We were trying to think what we could do, so we launched a reboot apparel store. Uh, we yes. got this whole COVID chat online. We gave it to yeah. V the Heroes. That was Connor's brain Yeah, yeah. Sick. We went with Sick. the COVID design. I don't know if you can see that <laughs> down there. Feed the Heroes, we love you. Donated everything <laughs> to that. So check out that. Cough, cough. Uh, plug, plug. Check out the reboot apparel store. We have that on lockdown. Yes. Some kill cool merch. Yes. Uh, other things we've been up to. One thing about us, we love to reach out to people. So anybody listening, connect with us. We're always looking to work on new projects. If Absolutely. you're an artist, hit us up with a premiere on our SoundCloud, our yeah. Bandcamp, or whatever you need. If you're a collective, let's work on something. Come down to Reboot TV. We do a live stream when the restrictions allow us to. We're all about that. That's what we love. That's what we're here for. We love the scene. We love everybody. And like, we're only a group of lads. Like, 
This is four lads and a few new members that just love the party. And can I just say one thing? Like, we're going to play in Amsterdam with the District 8 boys. Yeah! <laughs> right. So, like, speaking of this, playing, District 8. you better let you let rip. So oh, I'm no, let's say one thing about District 8, oh, man. Oh, yeah, go for it. Go for From it. From the hangar to everything, big boys. But you know what? They always look after little artists, bring the on board. And can I tell you, like, our friends, 190 was going over to Amsterdam. I don't. <laughs> yeah. I know this sounds like a cliche, but like Amsterdam won't know what hit it. You know? <laughs> <laughs> well, and then next steps, it, next steps, wait until you see, we have on lockdown. As I said, anybody in the country watching, want to get involved, hit us up. We're only normal guys, normal people. Come party with us, come play with us, do a project together, whatever you want to do. Underground Aviation. Yay, up there thank you so much. I'm going to pass these reins over to you and you let rip because we're excited to have you here. Thank you so much for coming down. And the guys, tell us what you want, what you're liking, more listens, the more that will play. But we'll just go freestyle, whatever you like. Love you, reboot, baby. Yep, yep, yep. So that's it, that's it. We're going to pass over now. So I'll leave it over to you. Thank you so much for tuning into the Raw Vision Mix Show. My name's Nat Mac, and you're just lovely. <laughs> Here we go.
we did say we had a competition. Those of you on Instagram, you've been following our little post here. We had a merch giveaway for Reboot DJs. So I'm going to give a little scroll here and you're going to pick someone, all right? So here we go. Right. Okay, right, 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 right. Uh, there. So we got Leanne Fruin. Leanne Fruin, yeah. Leanne Fruin, there we go. Leanne, Leanne Fruin. You've won the jumper and the tote bag. There we go, and some underground innovation stuff as well. So, do you want to talk about the other competition as well? Mountain Loop, that's all you Do you want me to announce it? Do you want to do it? Okay, right, the bigger one now. There we go. Right, okay, might as well. Let's double whammy, let's do it. Right, you ready? One, two, one. Jessica. Jessica Dimitra, you're going to Live Festival 2021. Happy days. Nice one, lads. So, do you want to... You... Uh, the, the winner of the Live Festival ticket will be uh, in contact with you in the next hour and a half, so stay tuned for that. Nice one, nice one. We've got Jamie Harris here coming on. So... Hey! So, we've got, we've got about 15 minutes left around about that. So, you know, knock it out of the park, yeah? Let's go.
crazy things I don't wanna know I got money in the
That's it, Raw Vision episode four. I don't. See, I thought you, I thought you were going to do something there, Jamie. I was like, the main unit. Nice one. Big tunes. Thanks so much. Thank you. Thanks to Rubu DJs for coming down. Thank you for everybody who tuned in. Big ups to all the winners who won the merch and the live festival ticket on Well Jelly. And if you want to keep tuning in, the Royal Vision Mix Show is every second Saturday and last Saturday of the month. And uh, we're going to try and do it outside in the next one, but we'll see how that goes. Thanks so much. That's it for episode four. My name's Nat Mac. This is Underground Ovation. Big ups to all of you. Big ups to the remote DJs. 
Thank you, thank you, thank you.